Spy X Family Episode 11 So they've been well recently they've been they've been focusing too much on academics. Eh maganda pa kaaliwa maga maganda naman ang explanation sa kanila noon ni Master Henderson that in order to gain stellas you should be either uh good academically or did something um uh did something outside of the school to make it proud. When they were doing community service, right? So yun na naisip ni ni Lloyd or si Twilight. Uh they Anya sucked at it, okay? Community service. In one moment, a kid was uh, a kid a kid slipped into the pool and yeah, started drowning. Eh Ah, uh, tawag dito. May, may injury siya sa isang sa isang panya so hindi makakalangoy talaga 'yon. Right? Na na sense ni Anya ito. Yung, yung, dito umandag yung pagka-telepath niya. Narinig niya yung cries for help ng ng batang ito. So takbo siya sa sa pool area ng ospital. Kunwari, ah uh, uh, sabi niya, "Oh, there's a swim, oh, there's a swim here." Nakita niya may may bulad, may bula rito ng ganun. All right? May may bulan lumalabas doon sa tubig. So, she assumed na nandoon yung nung yung nalulunod na bata. Langoy siya. No, dive in siya ganoon. Pero it the pool was too deep for her na kasi adult swimming pool pala ito. Eventually, she gave in na to to the death. Pero who comes to rescue her? Of course, si Lloyd. So, he rescues both Anya and the drowning and the drowning boy. Anya was commended by everybody in that pool area. Ano sabi niya? Uy, galing mo ah. Paano, galing mo na, na rescue mo yung bata nga ah. Good job. Good, good job, little lady. Good job. Gumagano na sila. Eventually, the Eden College found out and gave her the Stella. Tinato na sa kanyang ni Becky ko nung uh, anong, anong reward ang hihingin niya sa parents niya for, for gaining that Stella. Kasi nung sila niyang example yung sarili niya because kinwenta niya when when I gained the high marks in that in our last test binigyan nila ako ng isang tiara at isang magandang damit alright so eh ang naisip na lang ni Anya a year's worth of peanuts or a castle <laughs> eh kaysa na just naman ni ni Becky na why not get a, why not have them uh, buy you a dog kasi Uh, I I got a dog as a reward for one of the for passing one of the tests. Kaya si Gonzalo Anya. Hmm. Eventually, na pagbuwi ni pagbuwi ni Anya, hining hiningin na niya kila kay Lloyd. Pero winalan niya siya ni ni Yor, ng kanya ni ni Mama Yor. Na well, dogs uh dogs are living creatures. They're they're a big responsibility. So eh, that, Yor just gave. Give Anya the heads up on uh, on what's about to happen if she if she gets a dog. So yun nga, it's a huge responsibility. Siyempre, alagaan mo yun. Totoo naman yun eh. So, well, eventually, pumayag si Lloyd na, na bigyan, siya ng, bigyan siya ng aso. So, final scene. Ayun, namimili na ng breed si Anya kung nung gusto niyang ipabili kay, kay Papa Lloyd. Ay, gusto ko tong ano, Fox Terrier. Fox Terrier pa, ha? Mahal nun. <laughs> so, Bigo, mga ka-lifestyle, let's break that episode down now. Critics of Style. Pace! Naging tense lang ang pacing nung, uh, nung, ayun nga, nung nalulunod na yung bata. When, when that kid slipped into that pool. So, yeah. Talaga matitense ka eh. Pero all throughout, the episode was uh, slow and lighthearted. Right? Do I have complaints? No. It was tense when it needed to be. It was profound and slow when it needed to be. Right? So, I got no complaints about the pacing, guys. Flo naman. The first gear shift here was when <clears throat> that moment when Anya sensed uh, the boy's cries for help. It's a no-brainer for gearship, guys. Bakit? Dahil dito na-realize ni Anya yung kanyang worth 
bilang telepath. You can consider it a character, a character development gear shift for the main star of the show. Yeah. Second gear shift was when, ayun nga, in award na sa kanya yung Stella. Dahil nakabalita na nga ng, ng school na she, she was able to rescue a, a boy from drowning. No brain of a gear shift there. Kasi, well, um, the mission itself took a small step. Dahil nakatanggap na ng Stella si Anya. Yun nga ang objective ni Lloyd. And of course, uh, objective na rin, uh, object, goal na rin ni Anya yun. In order for, in order for her to, to help Papa Lloyd in his mission. Right? But of course, di niya, of course, di niya sinasabi yun. Final gear shift was when, um, that dog pound, yung dog pound scene, I call it a gear shift. Bakit? Kasi, I think a new character is about to be about to be introduced in this anime. Probably not in the um, not in the finale, but in siguro sa season two na. But it it is a good way to um to to get an idea of who's going to come in next into the Forger family's lives. So these three gear shifts that I saw. The second and third will either play a role in the finale or in season two. Plotwise, no side stories or backstories, not even an explainer sequence. Kaya, malinis ang plot bigo ng mga lifestyle. Patapos na ang season 1. Side stories and backstories, they're not cool anymore. Eh, hindi na sila cool na, ila na, lagyan, na ilagay dito. Explainer sequence? Fine. To further enhance the understanding of the audience. Pero yung side story, backstory, i-vivir away mo pa yung attention ng audience? Nope. Totally uncool, guys. So, pace, flow, and plot. They all came together for this episode post. So, Spotty X Family, episode 11. Why not? Two thumbs up. Bakit? Tandaan nyo. The object of Operation Strix, according to Lloyd, right now is to be phase two is to help Anya get those stelas. Kasi, para makapasok sila sa, sa Imperial Scholars Dinner at makasalamuha niya ang tatay ni Damian. Si, si, si Mr. Desmond mismo kasi ang target ni Twilight. Dahil pinagsususpechan siya ng Westalian government na well, na sisira sa peace talks between Westalis and Ostania. So, st uh, well, Anya receiving one Stella um, for Lloyd, that's a moderate step. Because, uh, may pagka-perfectionist din kasi si, ano, si, si Papa Lloyd. Wala eh. tayong magagawa. Okay? Si, he's a veteran spy. He's the world's most, well, he ain't the world's most dangerous spy for nothing. Right? Ganito kami tikuloso kasi si, si Twilight. So, can we talk about, uh, can we talk about season 2 now? Pwede. Kasi, I'm not expecting the finale to be, uh, to be a slam bang one eh. Okay, pero the usual lightheartedness nandun, the usual slice of life feels, pwede rin, because of Anya. So, well, when, the season 1 finale of Spy X Family comes along guys, just chill. Okay? You don't have to mentally prepare yourselves like uh, like Requiem of the Rose King, like Tomodachi Game, or even RPG Real Estate. Okay? It's upcoming finale. You don't have to... You don't have to... Uh, you, don't, you don't have to... Uh, yeah, you don't have to mentally prepare yourselves for those kinds of enemies. For, for Spy X Family, just chill lang. Just wait for the next episode to happen. So again, 
Spy X Family Episode 11 Two thumbs up Another two thumbs up for Spy X Family mga ka lifestyle Anya, 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 Anya So Bigo, wait for my next upload regarding this anime And for those of you who are still stuck with the CHD Abay, nauna na kayo ni Anya eh May Stella na siya, kayo wala pa <laughs> Kasi pa chill chill lang kayo dyan eh But anyway, enjoy this review and I'll see you in the next one.